We're working at Pig's Eye Island, just south of downtown St. Paul, Minnesota. The project is placing roughly 450,000 yards of sand that was previously removed from the, the Mississippi Riverbed over a countless amount of years. The project involves hydraulically pumping that material to several islands about 5,000 feet away from our slurry barge. The material is removed from several borrow sites about four miles south of the Mississippi by the prime contractor, LS Marine. That material is then transported by tug and deck barge four miles back upstream. It's tied off then at the slurry plant. The material then is offloaded by our green Senebogen 850, fed into our hopper and slurry tank system and then hydraulically pumped about 5,000 feet to the furthest island. Sequence wise, we're starting with the farthest island and working our way back towards shore here. Some surprises that we've ran into is the depths of the lake. We are expecting it to be fairly shallow, roughly two to three feet deep. So it's given us some challenges with getting equipment out there, especially for fueling and any maintenance that needs to be done. It's a team effort between Ellis Marine and Brennan to get the yardage here and get it to shape out on the island. Hitting that number every day is giving the guys confidence to keep going and we know what we need to do to hit those numbers and get the job done. From an environmental aspect, reusing these dredge materials can be beneficial to the environment and the ecosystem. Building these islands will take care of some wind erosion that they're starting to see on the, the north side of the lake, as well as some habitat restoration for local marine wildlife and potential growth for those islands will be very beneficial for the habitat around the lake, as well as recreational activities that might take place out here. It's a fairly decent sized lake and it would be nice to get some beneficial reuse out of it. We've got fairly small crew working six days a week, six to six. We've got guys rotating in and out so we get some guys some time off. It's definitely a family bond here at Brennan and the work is very rewarding too. Everyone's here for the same goal of make future growth and future opportunity. This project will have a meaningful impact with how many project stakeholders are involved. The Minnesota DNR, Ramsey County, the St. Paul District of Army Corps of Engineers and then our neighbors over in the St. Paul Yard LS Marine. It allows us to work with a smaller contractor and be able to bid this work together and work collectively to build these islands and, and strengthen our relationship with them. The reward is going to be very nice once these islands are built.